Hey Bear Cubs, Big Bear Dave here. And yes, you can pretty much guess what this video is going to be about from the title. <sighs> and of course, yes, thank you, Scott. But not for the reason why everyone else is thanking you for. You see, a, a few years ago, when I was in elementary school, I didn't have many friends. I, actually, I, I didn't have any friends at all. Um, th this is kind of hard to admit, but I have something called social anxiety. And for those who don't know what it means, it's basically, it's really hard for me to talk to anyone. Like, things that are as simple as having like a normal conversation, they tire me out and exhaust me the same way as lifting weights or working out with a normal person. And the only people I would ever talk to were my parents. It wasn't, it wasn't until the first Five Nights at Freddy's game came out that I was actually able to talk to people about something and not get exhausted from it. I, I was even starting conversations with complete strangers if they were wearing a FNAF shirt. And that's what I want to thank Scott for. Not just for making these wonderful games, but for being the reason I came out of my social shell, um... <laughs> now, with that being said, I want to make one thing clear to you guys. FNAF is definitely not over. Just because Scott retired, we the fans can continue the story the way we want to. Be it animations on YouTube, fan theories, or even just drawing Freddy with a box of crayons. We can continue where Scott left off. And spoiler guys, I'm going to do my part. As always, Bear Cubs, thank you for watching. And don't worry, Scott. We'll take it from here.